Welcome you guys to part one of episode one of Minecraft Story Mode. We are off to a nice little start here because we're in the main menu and we're going to finally choose what our character is as they do have six choices. So we can be a girl named Jesse or we can be a guy named Jesse. So I think we're going to choose the obvious route and just go with this and make it simple. And it's going to dig deep into the story. So hopefully you guys do enjoy this. If you guys do, then please make sure to leave a like and tell me what you guys think of the story and what choices that you guys made compared to mine. If you guys spoil the story for myself, I will remove your comment just so nobody else gets spoiled unlike me. So for like, I guess, you know, we're going to start. So enjoy whatever's ahead because I've not watched this. Nothing built can last forever, and every legend, no matter how great, fades with time. With each passing year, more and more details are lost, until all that remains are myths, half-truths. To put it simply, lies. And yet, in all the known universe, between here and the Far Lands, the legend of the Order of the Stone endures unabridged as self-evident fact. Indeed, it is only a troubled land that has need for heroes, and ours was fortunate to have, so long ago, four heroes such as these. Gabriel the warrior, before whose sword all combatants would tremble. Eligard the redstone engineer, whose machines would spark an era of invention. Magnus the Rogue, who would channel his destructive creativity for the benefit of all. And Soren the Architect, builder of worlds and leader of the Order of the Stone. These four friends together would give so much to gain their rightful place as four heroes. Their greatest quest would take them on a dangerous journey to fight a mysterious creature known as the Ender Dragon. In the end, the Order of the Stone emerged victorious and the dragon was defeated. Their story complete, they slipped away into the pages of legend. Nice little cinematic right there, story. But when one story ends, another one begins. Would you houses. rather fight a hundred chicken-sized zombies or ten zombie-sized chickens? Yeah. Just to be clear, ten zombie-sized chickens now. Arm. Come on. So I have to go with the giant chickens, not because I want to or because I think it would be easy, but because they would be an abomination. Imagine their giant feet. Like I said, an abomination. So, I've got a daylight sensor on the roof. Mm -hmm. And if I did this right, these lamps should turn on once it gets dark. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to just leave Reuben here with nothing while we're at the building competition. He's coming with us. Really? <laughs> what kind of question is that? Of course he okay, is. Okay, I'm not saying he shouldn't come. I'm not. But don't you think it's a little weird that you take him with you everywhere you go? He kind of makes us look like... No. I don't know. Damn it, no, Reuben's my Ruben's best my friend. Best Come friend. on now. I thought I was your best friend. Both of you are. I didn't mean anything by it. Yeah, I'm you did. He's You're trying to start something. I just don't want to give people one more reason to call us losers. But we are losers. I'm getting tired of it. Who cares what other people think? I know. I'm just... It wears you down. You say you're not a loser, Olivia. So win. Okay. Yeah, I win. Fine. Did you hear that? Oh, no. Boom! <laughs> what in the world? <laughs> oh, man. You guys totally freaked out. That was awesome. Uh... Axel, what's the matter with you? Great. Now I'm gonna smell like a pig in Endercon. That's what you get, Axel. I brought you good times and now I'm being punished for it? You scared us half to death. Nothing is fun if you're not scared half to death. Pretty did you sure. Bring the fireworks? Of course I did. I even brought something for the little guy. Nice. You brought Reuben a disguise? Um, we're going to a convention. Somebody's got to wear a costume. Uh huh. 
He looks awesome. Yes, he does. He looks so like awesome. A hours to build it. All right, all right. You definitely brought the fireworks, right? Yes, I'm ready. Waiting on you guys. If he was really your best friend, you wouldn't let him go outside dressed like that. The only thing more dangerous than putting a costume on a pig is trying to take it off. <laughs> Hurry up and grab your stuff. We'll meet you downstairs, okay? Okay. Oh, what can I do? This is odd. Playing a game like this is really weird. Shear is definitely taking these. Never know when I might need to shear some sheep. So what can we do? Look at the paintings, I guess. Oh, Gabriel the curses are slow. Warrior, you think we'll ever get that famous? It's not impossible. Maybe I'll get famous for my sweet poster collection. Okay, you just made this really weird, dude. And One let's of these see. days, we're gonna win the Endercon building competition, and when we do, people will look at us and say, "Hey, there goes Jesse and Ruben, winners of the Endercon building competition." They really should change the name. So he's talking to a pig. That's not odd at all. I got this stand as a gift, but don't have any armor to put on it. Maybe someday. Someday. See, it's Give foreshadowing. Give me a dragon roar, Reuben. That's actually pretty good. That'll do, Reuben. That'll do. I I don't like the smile that 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 the character gives. Can can I not look any further? Because I just looked all over the room. Ooh, chest. Hmm, flint and steel, not too shabby. I feel like we're taking like 10 years to actually do the stuff. Huh. So I guess that's it, so I suppose we should go down. Pigs really should be pets like this. That's everything. In Minecraft. Let's roll. Yeah, dude. Roll. Let's go. Roll. Heard pretty juicy rumor about the building competition, but you guys have to promise not to say anything. Okay. Also, it's in two parts. Each part more exciting than the last. Spit it out, Axel. Part one. The special guest at this year's Entercon is none other than Gabriel the Warrior, him freaking self. Whoa, what's part two? Part two, according to my sources, the winner of the building competition is going to get to meet him. It doesn't mean anything if we lose. But if we win, oh man, this would make up for all the losing. Meeting Gabriel would be a dream and an honor. Totally. He's awesome. It'd be amazing to meet him. These Ruben are some of the weirdest choices. Costume. The last time Gabriel saw a dragon, it didn't end well. So... Does this source of yours make posters for a living? Huh? Yeah, my uh, source uh, doesn't exist. You guys are my only friends. Guys, let's stay focused. We have a competition to win. We never win. And this year we've got Ruben oh. with us. We basically have no chance. Faith, have a Olivia. little faith. What? A little slice, a sliver. Uh, a portion, just a little faith. That's all we need. Also, I'm hungry. To win. No, no, I'm with that. All right. Wait a minute, wait a minute. We're thinking about this all wrong. The point of the building competition isn't just to build something. We have to do something to get noticed by the judges. Okay, then. So how do we do this? We don't just build something functional. We build something fun. After we finish the fireworks machine like we planned, then we build something cool on top of it. You might be onto something. If we want to get a reaction out of the judges, you build something scary. So I say we build a creeper. Wouldn't an Enderman be better? I'm more scared of Endermen than creepers. They both have their moments. They're both pretty scary. Then again, huh. you scared the crap out of us with a creeper today. <laughs> I think Let's Enderman. build an Enderman. Ah. Uh... Olivia's Creepers are too stereotypical. Are you whining? No, I was saying awesome. Yeah, I think this is the first time we've decided on something before getting to the competition. Think we've got everything we need? It wouldn't hurt to grab a little more. Let's get to grabbing then. We're so prepared. We can't lose. Cannot. Bring it in. <laughs> Dare to prepare on three. No, no, no. Preparing is daring. No, that's. 
that's the same thing. Forget it. Uh, team on three. One, two, three. Team. team. <laughs> this is like really not the storyline I was kind of expecting. So now we have to spam keys. That's great. We're going back to our roots, you guys. Am I am I just pressing A down or S down? Okay, so Q. Okay, so this this is not what I was expecting anymore. So we're Am I spamming Q? I really don't E Q. <laughs> Okay, so this is really different from the usual game that Telltale still makes. Okay, so you're running. <laughs> I really don't know what we're doing now with our lives. Okay. So is there supposed to be like a real story attached now? Or is this supposed to be like the leading up to it? I hope you guys really don't hear me mashing my keyboard. Okay, that was weird. That pig's face. Oh, that's going to be the picture art. Oh, maybe. Maybe. That could be the thumbnail right there, you guys. We know what we're building. We've got all the stuff for it. We are so ready. This year, it's going to be different. I'm not just ready to build. I'm ready to win. Nice pig, losers. Mm. Oh, They're just great. jealous. There's Lucas and the Ocelots. The rivalry continues. Man, they've got matching leather jackets and everything. So That's cool. even worse. Well, well. Why well. would you want to match? If it isn't the order of the losers. <laughs> great. <laughs> the fail squad's here. Lucas, get a load of these losers. Let's go, guys. Name, please. Axel. And, uh, how do you do? No, your team name. Team name? We are oh. not ready for this. We surely aren't. <laughs> um... So much for losing anonymously. No, we're going order to be the Order of the Pig. Of the pig. <laughs> really? Yes. Are you to Reuben, or are you making fun of me? Okay, Order of the Pig. You guys are in booth five. They can judge us all they want, but you, they know that's an MLG name. Yeah, how old are our characters? I'm pretty sure they told us about our call. So let's take a look. Hmm. What are we set with? Nope. Nothing? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Uh, I suppose we want to go right. I'm trying to make sure that we're getting everything because they said there's like hidden storyline stuff. It's like everyone in town is here. So I want to make sure that we get everything and that we get our necessities. Oh, this is odd. Do I look over here? Oh, the mouse is really weird. I don't like the look of this. Yeah, they're spoopy people. So are we able to loot this? No. I thought there was stuff to loot over here. Is that a freaking beacon? They have a freaking beacon? A beacon? That freaking means they have to kill a wither. Beacon? That's stained glass. They aren't just building a beacon. They're building a rainbow beacon. Oh, they're pretty MLG. We're gonna lose. No, we got what are this. Worried about? We've got this. Who are we kidding? We've got nothing. We've got a mascot. Yes, we should an MLG stop mascot. Staring at them. <laughs> Look, it's the Order of the Losers again. <laughs> Good one, Gil. Good one. We're just looking. There'll be plenty of time for you all to look at it after it wins and gets shown at Endercon. You're being unpleasant. Maybe not all of you. Endercon doesn't allow outside food or drink. <laughs> oh. I'm talking about your pig. Shut up. What's that? Jesse said, shut up. Do yes, shut up. Again? Fight, fight, fight. I don't know. Maybe. Stop wasting your time, Aiden. We've got work to do. Oh, I was hoping for a fight. You're lucky I'm busy. Yeah, listen to your mom. Hey, Jesse. Guys. Hey, Petra. How's the bill going? Only time will tell, but 
We're optimistic. Hey, Petra. I forgot to thank you for that nether star. Hey, Lucas. Not a problem. Aww. Help these tools. For the right price, I'll help anyone. If you need anything, you know where to find me. None so of us she's know a where money digger. Er, exactly. Gold digger. Man, I no can't. No hard even think. feelings, guys. And if you're cool with Petra, you're cool with us. So why don't we just forget about all this and, you know, make this about how cool our builds are? May the are. best team win. May the best team win. Careful what you wish for. We'll see about that. Ladies yes. and gentlemen, welcome to the Endercon building competition. The winners of this year's competition will have their build featured at Endercon. The winners will also meet in person Gabriel the Warrior. I don't really like that lady for some reason. Her skin just doesn't. No. Whoa, handshake? We don't have a handshake. Pig. Would That's gonna be our. Up? Oh. We'll call it the. Uh, the warrior whip. The yes. The warrior whip. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and just like that, I'm nervous again. Don't talk like that. We can do this. Just stick to the plan, and everything will be fine. Yes. This just... year, the order of the pig can't lose. The order of the pig. <laughs> Oh, that's so great. Let's do it. Building starts now. I really hope we don't actually have to build besides mash buttons. Okay, so this is going to be really interesting. Oh, come on, we got to mash. Oh, oh no. it's starting to lag. A fireworks dispenser. I'm so scared. <laughs> you worry about your build, and we'll worry about ours. Really should beat him up. So what's next? Oh, Q. We're still mashing. Oh, they're building the Enderman. It's going to have fireworks in it. That's going to be really cool. Okay, maybe not. This just turned out ugly. What is he doing? Huh. Oh, he's comparing. And now, the moment of truth. How are any of Here these builds nothing. good? This looks so cool. We'll win this for sure. No. I gotta admit, this Enderman is sweet. Good call, Jesse. Really? I mean, it depends if it's Guys, going to keep continuously shooting it. Good build, man. What? No way. Such low expectations. It's just a bunch of dyed wool. Whoops. No, oh gosh. Oh no, Ruben's on fire! Ruben, no, come back! It was Aiden that pumped. The lava's getting closer. Gonna ruin the build. Ruben's going to get lost. What do we do? We've got to do something. No, we got to save our Ruben. Build is about to go up in flames. We've got to get Ruben. Ruben is babe, and we have to save him. Oof. We're right behind you. I mean, if that's what they want to do, I mean, one of them could have just saved the build. I mean, I would hope they come to help us. Because Ruben, Ruben is our friend. We have to make sure we take care of our friends. I don't see him anywhere, Ruben. The sun's going down. We gotta find him fast. He could have gone anywhere, and this part of the woods is huge. We stand a better chance of finding him if we split up. If either of you get lost, just use the lights from Endercon to make your way back to town. Got it? Got it. Or a build that's on fire. <laughs> Ruben? Where are you? Just give me an oink if you can hear me. He is so gonna get jumped. Could that be Ruben? Oh, uh, that could be. Oh, that could be a witch hut if you think about it. Like, I've never seen the game, but, you know, if you think about it. Right? Click the Just call, Ruben. Just oink if you can hear me. Okay. Spoopy. Okay, so we're still exploring. Hoof prints. Hmm, pig tracks. Pig tracks, okay. So I suppose that means we should go over here. I love the detail on the ground. I feel like Ruben, there's going to be a be witch out hut. Here in the dark. I love how there's a carrot over there. 
Okay, so we're still looking at stuff. These definitely belong to a pig. Hmm, huh. there's no way Reuben made these on his own. Huh, so can we not look at this? I mean, we have the well here, so we can look at that. Can I look at you? Reuben? Is there anything else? I'm trying to make sure that we cover everything, you guys. Reuben? Come Reuben, on, come Reuben. Here, boy. I hear some pigs. I mean, he's going to make everything burn down, so... Hashtag blame Reuben. Hey, Reuben. I got a carrot for you. Where are you, buddy? Okay, that was a bit weird. Like, how he phrased it is just really awkward. Reuben! Did he find him? Ew. Reuben, are you in there? Okay, so that means we have to really examine them. Hmm. So this is really Egg. interesting. Wouldn't Reuben still technically have the crap on, probably Reuben. rolling around? No, not you guys. Pigs! Hey, all pigs but Reuben, shut up! Well, that's a bit feisty. Are you over here? Oh, we can look over here. Nope, still nothing. Come on. Over here, maybe? The shrubbery. Does that mean we keep walking? I'm guessing. That would only make sense. Feel like he's gonna fall in a cave. It's getting scary out here. Maybe not. Ooh, so we're actually finding his costume. Come on, sprint. Reuben, Reuben. Oh no, you in there, buddy? No. Oh, you really geez, think he would? Don't be toasted, Reuben. Remember, Smokey the Bear would say, put out wildfires. Okay, so we're still exploring. Okay, so... Ooh, wait, what is this? That looks like a map. <laughs> I don't know. Spoopy. Ooh, what is this? This is really interesting. Redstone torches. And then the sound effects. Well, of course we're going to look at it. Why would yeah. we... Oh. We should go in. I dare you to go Ruben, in. Is that you? He should have went in. That would have made my day. <laughs> Where's the little pig at? <laughs> Can't be that hard. It's going to be a pack of wild wolves that jumps out. How much you want to bet? And let's see, is it actually him? Oh. Reuben, there you are. Hey, buddy, you want a carrot? So, it sounded like a pack of like a wolf. Okay, let's get, get out of here. here. Reuben. Hope you're ready for some more walking. We gotta hurry back to town if we don't want to run into. <laughs> I love how they walk like stereotypical Ruben, zombies. I think, I think we're good. I think we made it. <laughs> oh, I thought I moved quickly enough. Oh yeah, I have a wooden sword. Back! Get back! W and S Stay to move. I got you. Why would it be W and S? Wouldn't it be A and D? Well, I guess that works too. I so did not press D right there. Oh, his arm actually does look hurt. 
Okay, so we're gonna go for you. Um. Uh, okay. I mean, if this is how they want to play it, it's really awkward. Come on. Let's get this MLG skill of ours out. Oh. Well, that guy just went a bit MLG. <laughs> you just break the... Dude. Stupid wooden swords. That's why we got flint and steel. How much you want to bet that peach or girl comes and rescue us or whatever her name is? Something. You're gonna have to make a run for it, okay? I'll meet you back in town, I promise. Come on, Ruben, you gotta run. Get out of here now! <laughs> oh, we about to get jumped. Come on, you got this, Jesse. Get off me! Oh, what in the world do we have here? Okay. Lots of mashing in the keyboard. See, told you. She was going to come and made sense. Come on, let's get out of the open. Okay, so now we're following this weird something. girl. Not that this isn't a really cool, dimly lit tunnel, but how far away is this thing you want to show me? Careful, Jesse. You don't want to get a reputation as a wimp. Y y this isn't my first time in a cave, Petra. Yeah, but have you ever seen a wither skull? Whoa! Fresh Why? from the nether. You're the first person I've showed it to. That's insane, Petra. You could have gotten yourself killed. <laughs> Don't worry so much. I can handle myself. No, she can't. There's this guy I'm meeting up with at Endercon. He's gonna trade me a diamond for it. A diamond? Being the Runic charges game, like a few diamonds on the server. Literally. The guy you got the skull for, what's his deal? He's kind of strange, I guess. But hey, everybody's got their thing. And you've never thought to ask him, hey, what's with your whole... Totally normal, not at all weird skull thing. As long as this guy is willing to pay, I earned that diamond. Only a diamond. Wow, what? In a single day, you went to the nether, you killed a wither skeleton. I mean, I did build a super cool statue, but still. It's pretty sweet being you, huh? You know, you could come with me. I mean, if you're too nervous, I totally get it. But I wouldn't mind a little backup. You I'm want all in. me to come with you? Consider it my charitable act for the day. <laughs> I'll consider it whatever you want me to consider it, as long as I get to come. You just keep a crafting table down here? Comes in handy. Since that wooden sword of yours got busted... You're giving me a new one? Even better, you can make your own. One stick plus two stones equals one sword. Wow. Just so you guys, you oh. we are actually going to end off the first part here. If you guys do enjoy it, then please make sure to leave a like and comment down below. Don't forget there are going to be other parts that come out through the day. But anyways, I will catch you guys in the next video. Take care.